Hey guys, this is Adam Lane with PocketNow.com, and you're watching the software tour of the new T-Mobile HTC Radar 4G. Next up, we're going to take a look at the software and what kind of programs were bundled with this HTC Radar 4G for T-Mobile. Uh, as you know, both HTC and T-Mobile are able to add some uh, programs with this before they sell it. So here's, this is actually the default home screen, and we see T-Mobile has decided to pin T-Mobile TV and Slacker Radio to the start screen. And this is uh, similar to what you've seen before, uh, pretty much just a rebranded version of Moby TV. So you can scroll and uh, play certain TV programs. you get the idea. And Slacker Radio we've seen before, just streaming music. And as we go down we have more default live tiles and we, here we have some more that T-Mobile has added. Netflix and Telenav GPS. This hasn't changed much though for the Mango version of Windows Phone. And we have HTC's Hub that is included as well as HTC Watch. Both of those are included by default but HTC has some nice new programs that you can download uh, specifically for this type of device or rather their new Mango devices. The My Account app is also included from T-Mobile. This is good for checking your balance, uh, seeing how many minutes you have left, that kind of thing. We have Notes from HTC is also included. So we've seen that before, we can add some notes. They don't really think with anything, so it's not terribly useful. And now there's a few things that I've downloaded from the HTC Hub. Doc mode is pretty cool. This is uh, something that would show up when you slide into a dock and uh, you got kind of cool access to music. Big clock, all at the same time. Here's a brightness. That'll automatically change the brightness down. Pretty cool. And we got pictures, slideshow. I have it set to do uh, random transitions. So you can have some slideshow uh, pictures going on while it's in the dock. Pretty neat feature. Flashlight, of course I have to download that. This is going to turn on the back. The uh, flash on the back. Connected Media, this is a DLNA app. So you can see music video on media servers and pictures. So there's a media server and there's my media center and it's going to load the folders. Sometimes it takes a while to get... You see the dots? There we go. There's my music. Now of course you can only play things that uh, the device supports so some of the recorded TV shows may not play properly over the network Now settings. HTC has done some cool things with the settings. Uh, you got some custom ringtones, you got a custom HTC theme which is just a different shade of green. And here's internet sharing. So this device does support internet sharing if you have it on your account. And there's my information. And now all I have to do is connect something else. So here's the zoom and it's going to connect to the HTC radar. And that works just fine. You gotta wait for it though. Anyway, let's go back. We also have some customizations down here. 
You got attentive phone. These are some of HTC's cool features for uh, turning the phone over to mute it, flip it over to turn the speaker on when you're in a call, that kind of thing. It's really nice to have it in the settings. Oops. Oh, we have camera modes, which uh, doesn't have any settings, but <laughs> it's there. The real settings are in the camera. Sound enhancers uh, in the settings. So that's good. You can change some of those options. And you also have SIM applications. I don't have any on the SIM, but that's a good thing to have there. And that's about it for the custom add on apps and uh, settings and whatnot. Let's show you HTC. This one is uh, Mango compatible. So we've seen this before. You can pin stocks to your start screen. And there's that. You can pin different cities to your start screen. and as well as news feeds. So this is all uh, Windows Phone 7.5 compatible. Pretty nice update. And the rest is uh, basically Windows Phone 7.5 that we've seen before. Now for the camera, let's press the camera button. Now this supports touch. I touch that corner and it focuses on that corner and then takes a picture. So we have multiple focus points. We also have the front facing camera. So we can see me there. And we have video switching and we have options. There's some good options here. Panoramic shot and burst shots. Those are new. We got some extra controls. Face detection. Pretty nice features there. And when you're in the video, we also have some effects. Continuous focus is on. You can choose the resolution 720p, so that's as much as you can get. And you can choose some effects and some other controls there. So there you have the software tour for the HTC Radar 4G for T-Mobile. And if you enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up, and that's it for now.